What's going on, everyone? Chris from PickDogs.com here with your free pick in the Vanderbilt versus Virginia Tech college week one college football matchup going down Saturday, August 31st, 2024. Just a reminder, if you haven't already, make sure you're subscribed to our channel and smash that thumbs up. And if you're looking for my best bets, the games that I love, including my daily $19 best bet, head on over to PickDogs.com and click the Premium Picks tab at the top of the page. But let's get to this one between the Vanderbilt Commodores and the Virginia Tech Hokies. you got Vandy coming in off a 2-10 season last year, 0-8 in SEC conference play. But they made some changes in this Commodores, um, Commodores coaching staff. Tim Beck coming over from New Mexico State to be the new offensive coordinator for the Commodores. And he brings over Diego Pavia. Now, Pavia was, was a bit of a question mark for a good chunk of the year last year, but he came on strong down the stretch towards the end of the season. He was a baller for you know a lot of people. A lot of people love Diego Pavia, and now he takes his talents to Nashville. Well, Nate Johnson going to come in to provide some challenge for Pavia, but Pavia, a dual threat, and he can move the ball with his feet. He can move the ball with his arm. And I think that the Commodores are going to be, you know, an improved team, but it's going to take some time because, you know, the receiving core, they need retooling. Their top three receivers from last year are all gone from the program. And this is also going to be a, a transfer-laden uh, defense for the Commodores as well. I think it's just going to take some time for this Vanderbilt team to gel. On the other side, you have Virginia Tech. They went 7-6 and six overall last year. They went 5-3 and three in ACC play. They blew out Tulane in the Military Bowl. They've got some returning production as well. Chiron Drones is back at quarterback. I want to see him improve on his 58% completion percentage last year, but still 17 touchdowns to just three picks. He's a dual threat as well. He ran for 818 yards, five touchdowns. Basial Tootin's back in the backfield alongside Drones. There's, there's some great receivers for Virginia Tech as well. The defense for Virginia Tech is still solid. They're going to have some, some uh, returning production as well, some nice transfers coming in. So I think when it boils down to it, I, I lean towards the over. The, the over was my initial look in this game. But the more I look at it, the more I'm looking at Virginia Tech here. I just think it's a spot where, you know, Vanderbilt is going to be able to compete for a little bit. We're going to see some solid stuff from Diego Pavia. Not going to be intimidated going up against Virginia Tech. And this is a big number to feel like, like we're laying on the road with the Hokies. But I think the talent's just going to win out here for Virginia Tech. Now, normally, you know, you think there may be an SEC team. Still going to be a tough out at home. But Vanderbilt was pushed around a fair bit last year. I need to see them sort of bounce back before I really put my faith in them long term. This is still, like I said, a really good Hokies team. And I think that, you know, it's just going to be one of those spots where Virginia Tech pulls away in the second half, gets a couple of key turnovers, gets a couple of key scores, and ends up winning this game by, I think, 17 to 21 points. So I'm going to take Virginia Tech laying the points to lean towards the over as well. And that's going to be my free pick. But just a reminder, if you haven't already, make sure you're subscribed to our channel and smash that thumbs up. And if you're looking for my best bets, you can find those at Pick Dogs Premium. While you're at Pick Dogs, check out our betting tools. They're 100% free. They're the best betting tools in the business and tools that you want to make sure that you have in your back pocket when you're making your best bets for the day's action. Thanks for watching. See you guys soon.